Welcome back, my friends, to the show that never ends. Um, it's Breath of Fire. We've got to find the stairs that lead up. I don't know exactly where we're going to do that, but uh, those are going down. We don't want that. I don't really know where we're meant to go, folks. Luckily, the enemies here are not really that challenging. Uh, I took a little... Stepped away from this game, not for long, but just for a minute or two. Boat leveled up. Uh, and, um... Now I forget exactly where I've already gone in this maze, so... He's almost dead. Abitar. I guess it makes sense he'd have weaker magic resistance than the two magic users and the magical fused freak mutant. Okay, folks. Uh, you know, I haven't been talking that much. Sorry. One of the American Gladiators. Oh, hey, good. I went the right way. What do you know? There might be treasures that I'm missing, but, you know. To fight this little weird kid. Do, 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 do. There's no need to use it. See, I wasted all of Ox's magic, but I'm not going to use Ox in this fight, so, uh, 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 brilliant strategy on my part. Not that Nina's run out of battle, uh, magic in a battle for a really long time. Fighting in the dream world is not the same as in the real world. But I am a mutant freak. Okay, let's see what we're gonna do here. I think I remember something about this guy being immune to magic until after you've damaged him with physical attacks. I read a little bit about him in fact, not because I was desperately worried, but... I don't know, let's just not have Bo use magic yet. Blue, I mean. Bow is just like, uh, Wolf Brand Jack really wants his soul back, baby. Uh, Yay, dragon. Um, maybe I have to have stupid kid and uh, mole guy in the party for him to. Well, I can... Well, you know what? I'll take Blue out of the party for the moment. I just saved, so, you know, what the heck. If it turns out having Blue in the party doesn't help anything, I'll take him back out of the party. It's simple enough. You can't use this special power. I just cannot use the special power, folks. I don't know why I keep thinking I can. 
Oh, I was able to hit it. That's good. Time out. Yes. Alright, so it looks like I don't have to have him in the party. It's just this guy has really high evade. I can deal with that. Let's bring black, blue, ba blue back in. Blue. And she can whack it with a stick for a while until something uh, something about it, once it starts getting pixelated, magic will start working. So. Time out. Avatar is I don't know what frozen. Yeah, looks like the avatar's frozen. Slam! Shock. Miss. Miss. <laughs> Shock is just missing all over the place. I wonder if she can, like, take him out of timeout mode. Apparently not. Oh well, I guess this attack it. Oh, the avatar's not time out of the mode anymore anyway. He's, he's stopped shouting and he's been allowed to come out of the corner and join the rest of the family for breakfast. Poison time. There's another download completed. Hopefully this one, like the last one, uh, will puzzle you that I'm even talking about it because you won't be able to see it. No, not... Darn it. Having some control issues here. Get well soon, myself. Oh, you can't dodge a lightning attack. That's not fair. Yeah. I guess dragons might be immune to poison. I really don't know. Maybe I should be using magic on this guy, and it's just being it's silly of me not to. I don't know. I really have no idea how whether or not this is an effective strategy. I mean, he's not really hurting me at all, so I guess that's good. Let's try Comet, just for the heck of it. His comet to scrub our oh, we won't even get a chance to. <laughs> well, that was ridiculous. He said something about him getting pixelated, but... You've beat me, but you're still to be trapped in this world forever. Biatch. And it guy slowly fades, and we get turned into urine. Oh, maybe we won't be trapped in this world forever. Yeah, he said that, and it's, like, completely not true. <laughs> what an idiot. Mogu, look! Do, do, do. What's the matter? What's the matter, Doomoon? Oh, look who's here! Thank you for saving my grandson. I'm so happy to see all of you. Mogu, I was so worried about you. Let's jump up and down like idiots. I had a dream. I had an awesome dream. People in the park. Playing games in the dark. In fact, that didn't seem like a dream at all. My my, my courage, it was real. Join your, join your party again? No way. Thank you all. What? He didn't even let us say no. <laughs> Alright. Great. We got everybody. This theory, this means I should start collecting agile hats. Be nice to my brother. Eh, yeah, piss off, kid. Please look after Mogu. Piss off, Grandma. Please look after Mogu. Piss off, Grandma. Please look after Mogu. Piss off, Grandma. Okay, what do we do now? Well, we've got a guy who can dig. That's got to be worth something, right? Oh no, am I... Uh, ooh, I've been free from my hellish prison. Please let me remain free. I don't think so. I think it's time for you to morph bodies with a freak again. No, oh, come on, baby, you ain't gotta do that. Uh, 
I've been your most faithful friend, except, well, I mean, Nina's been in the party longer than me, but, you know, I've been your most faithful male friend. I know I can't compete with a sweet piece of loving like that, but still, all right, shut up, bro. Are you confused together with them, Khan? Indeed. Khan! Okay, so let's, so let's get on with it. Uh, now I need to find uh, diggable bits of land so we can dig it, dig it, dig it. Yeah. I know that there are such things. Right? Ah, see, that's an example of what I'm looking for. Anything with that goofy little it looks like antlers for some reason. I can dig and get stuff and yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not, not interested in killing you. It's a palette swap of what used to be a boss. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I don't know where that came from. Alright, let's get on with it here. Oh, jeez. Sorry, folks, I really didn't intend to get on uh, YouTube and start, you know, belching. They were quiet belches. Okay, so um, I'm gonna probably do some of this backtracking off camera, but maybe not. Maybe I'll let you watch. This is what I'm. Oh, never mind. You can't do anything with that. Fine. Be that way, Gobi. I thought you were gonna be like useful and stuff. It's only the holes in the ground that he can do anything with. So we have to. We have got to find some. There's more fusion forms that Karn can take than uh, he's currently using. We've got to find some of the other ones. I'm pretty sure there was something near Aurea. No, that was one of the ones that you have to have some weird fusion form to do anything with. So let's try. Uh, there's one near Tantor, I think. There you go. I might want to just cut to the chase and bust out a fact that will tell me where exactly what these things are so I don't waste a lot of time searching, but... I'm almost positive there's something up here. Here we go. Alright, let's see what's going on in this zone. Thanks, man. Thanks for digging a hole in here. Oh, you're welcome, guys. Does this mean I can be an active part of the party? No. There's a luck potion. Trap trigger to boom. Crab. Avatar collapse severe damage. Crap! Should have let uh, Mutant Hellbeast guy be the leader of the party. Forgot about trapped chests. It's been a long time since I've had to worry about one, I suppose. Um, clogs make you faster, I think, but yeah, who cares? So I've dug a hole into a secret hidden underground, whatever this is. I grabbed the napotent and completely forgot that I'm supposed to be using him as the party leader so that I don't trigger traps. Aha! A V potent. Maybe it's time to give some of this potence to uh, the other lady on my team. I'm a princess! I'm supposed to be getting this stuff! I wonder what their vigor is like, comparatively speaking. She has a vigor of 97, which is not that good. She has a vigor of 104, so Nina probably needs vigor more. He's got the worst vigor in the history of the world. And the video's almost over. Okay, well, this is good timing. You got to see me explore one of these little treasure troves, so... Now you know what that's about. That's good. And, uh, I could probably off-camera look up some other ones so that we can get back to the plot. So, that sounds like a plan to me. What do you say, gentle viewer? 
Uh, when we come back, folks, I will have dug up some treasure and hopefully figured out another transformation.